Hey YouTube, this is Dean making another vid. If you love my content, please consider hitting the like button. Also, please consider subscribing, as it is very much appreciated. Well, there it is. Bought that lump of petrified wood. 50 bucks. 52 kilos of petrified wood. Um, there's a 12 inch ruler, or 30 centimeter ruler. It's, um, that's 12 inches. So it's 22 inches, 20, 23 inches long, or that's, that's, that's 30 centimetres, fifty-five, fifty-eight centimetres long, yeah, it's a beast. Um, eight inches deep, 20 centimetres deep. As I said, 55 kilos, I weighed it. Um, yeah, $50, Blake charged me for it, which is incredible. I paid $100 for that, $100 for that piece there. Um, there's bits of opalization running through it. He said there was chalcedony running through it too. I really haven't had a good look because it's so bloody heavy. It's over 100 pounds. Um, it's hard to manipulate around. I can barely lift it up. I, I struggle to get it to. As I said, I hope that's in frame still. Um, yeah, there's opalization in it. Anyway, it's a magnificent piece of wood. Lots of bark. Big there, big, lots of bark. Um, yeah. I cleared out a spot over there. I'm going to put it over there. Put all, push most of my rocks over there. Um, yeah, I'm going to put it over there. Because, um, yeah, it's there's nowhere else to put it, really. Um, yeah, he asked me if I was going to cut it up or anything. It's just, it's such a big piece and such a beautiful piece of wood that um, I'm not going to break it up. Because yeah, it, yeah, it does spark. I've tried sparking on it. Um, in some spots, it, some of it's a little bit, a little bit rounded off from that. But you go into sharp edges, it does spark. But I didn't buy it for that. I just love this sort of beautiful rock. Um, yeah, wood. But that is definitely the biggest piece I've ever seen personally in one lump. And um, yeah, it's um, yeah, fantastic talking piece. And um, I'm just glad I got it for such a such a price. But anyway, he was moving and he didn't didn't um couldn't have it. So yeah. But anyway, I wanted to show you that. And um, yeah, just happy to have got it. I was on Gum Tree. I don't go on it very often because um, yeah, I don't want to go down the rabbit hole too much. But um, with it, but you do get occasional people selling off bits but um yeah this is i'm just in awe of it um apparently found at lowwood which is a little town just outside of brisbane here um i don't know must have been on a farm or something and they saw it there and picked it up apparently he had a, he's got he said he had heaps of it but it was all his grandma um grandparents stuff and it, he didn't seem very excited about getting rid of it um so yeah I, I i said keep me in mind if um he was going to sell any off but um yeah he didn't sound very excited about it but um yeah because i actually went up went up and knocked on his door i saw in one part he had a whole he had like i don't know 30 pieces just little chunks sitting there i thought i might be able to have bought a few more of him but yeah I'm just glad I got this piece um yeah it took me and, me and Lawson to actually carry it up here because uh, yeah 50 kilo piece 100 pound piece it's hard to manipulate um I'm not getting any younger young days I would have picked this up by myself and thrown it around like it was nothing but yeah um as I'm getting older I, I just can't pick it up as easy um yeah I just don't want to hurt myself but anyway yeah quite a big piece um yeah it's 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 not a bad piece at all
magnificent piece of petrified wood. You can actually see the, the bark and all that, you know, like say so, yeah, and um yeah, some of the some of the uh, opalization. It's only only little bits and pieces of opalization in it, but yeah, fantastic display piece. I'll have it out here because there's nowhere else to put it really. Um, I don't want to. Once it goes downstairs, basically, uh, no one will ever see it again. So yeah, I want to want it as display piece up here. Anyway, that's what I got today, and um, as I said, I'll do my flint and steel Saturday as per normal, and then I'm going over to. Jack's on Sunday to do some forging. But anyway, I'll um I'll do videos about that as per normal. Anyway, thanks for watching.